Hello and welcome to another one of my videos. Today's video will be looking at the 2015-2016 Royal Engagements. Prince Harry, Prince William and Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge all upped their royal duties in 2016. However, Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh, who at age 95 still does more. A study of the court circular which records royal engagements shows that all three younger royals have markedly increased their duties this year compared to the same period in 2015. However, the younger royals are still eclipsed by the Queen and Prince Philip and other older members of the family who have retained a very similar work pattern to last year and undertaken the bulk of the family's 2,273 engagements so far with Prince Charles and Princess Anne completing the most. Prince William, Duke of Cambridge, despite his part-time role as an air ambulance pilot working up to 80 hours per month, has taken on a 30% increase in royal duties in the first seven months of this year. His rise from 68 engagements to 89 was bettered by his brother Prince Harry, who left the army in June last year. Harry's official workload has gone up by 57% from 54 to 85 engagements. Catherine, the Duchess of Cambridge, who was off on maternity leave for much of the first half of last year, has increased her workload from 27 official engagements to 69. Her Majesty, the Queen, has reached 211 engagements with around 68% of those undertaken at a royal residence. She is still doing about the same as last year. In recent years, many smaller adjustments have been made for the Queen. These changes are in deference to her age, but are not aimed in reducing her workload, merely to make formal engagements more comfortable. The Queen has now reduced the amount of long haul overseas official tours she conducts, opting to delegate these to other senior members of the family. Prince Charles has represented his mother at the Commonwealth Heads of Government meetings. More investitures are held annually with smaller numbers reducing the amount of time spent standing. Other senior members also conduct these such as Prince William, the Duke of Cambridge. The Queen also spends more time at Windsor Castle reducing the amount of work days at Buckingham Palace to two or three per week. The Queen, however, still receives her red boxes, full of state papers daily, wherever she is. The Queen no longer stops outside the gates of Buckingham Palace after trooping the colour, as demonstrated this year for the first time in 2016 for the 90th birthday parade. Neither does she climb the ceremonial staircase in the Houses of Parliament. In 2016, for the first time, she took the lift. Her summer break to Balmoral has also been extended to allow further time for rest and recovery. These adjustments, and many other smaller ones, are all part of what has become affectionately known as the Gentle Succession. Prince Charles, the Prince of Wales, is on 333 engagements, while his sister, Princess Anne, the Princess Royal, has totaled 331. Princess Anne has performed more official duties than any other member of the royal family. It is believed that William, Catherine and Harry's focus is on quality over quantity, campaigning on edgier issues such as removing the stigma surrounding mental health problems and highlighting the renewed dangers of HIV and AIDS in Britain. Here we see the Royal Trio for their Heads Together campaign charity. We also see Prince Harry taking a HIV test to raise awareness. Indeed, it is hard sometimes to compare engagements. One royal might do three in one hour, while another could spend four hours at an army base, for example, talking to soldiers, families, reviewing tactics and having lunch with the officers. But it might still only show and count as one engagement. 
Prince Philip, the Duke of Edinburgh, completed 130 duties in the first seven months of 2016 alone. Prince Andrew, a champion of young technology startup companies to Britain, and also with his Pitch at the Palace initiative, did 204 engagements in the first seven months of the year. Here we see another shot of Prince Andrew for the Pitch at the Palace. Younger brother, Prince Edward, the Earl of Wessex, performed 185. His wife, Sophie, the Countess of Wessex, performed 130. Meanwhile, Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall, undertook 161 engagements. The royal family's unsung, more low-key heroes performing a high amount of engagements were the Duke of Gloucester on 126, his wife, the Duchess of Gloucester, on 75, the Duke of Kent with 104 engagements, and finally Princess Alexandra on 50. I leave you with a balcony group family photo. I'm sure you can see many of the royals which we spoke about today on the balcony. If you've liked this video, please like, please leave a comment. I always enjoy replying to the comments. Please share on social media. And I also have the Royal Reviewer page on Facebook. Thank you for watching from me in Shropshire. Until next time, goodbye.